I'm not like satisfied. Oh, it's getting cold. Good morning. We got to go to class. It's 10.41. shoes today. These ones. It's not that cold outside. Anyway, we are on our way officially to the DCL. <laughs> It's really unnecessary to focus on lecture. All his notes are just online and his notes are literally like 80 pages full of lecture notes. And when he literally just talks in class, he kind of just like reads off all the lecture notes and I'd, you know, rather be doing other things, so. Today's lunch, we are eating egg drop soup. I made this yesterday for the first time ever. I can link the recipe in the description, but it's actually so good. Why am I a literal chef? I put shrimp in it too for protein purposes. Oh, also my roommate's Chinese, like fully Chinese, and she tried it and she said it was actually really, really good, really authentic. This is called greens and reds. Actually has changed my skin. I used to struggle with acne and then I got an Accutane and then it like kind of came back a little bit. So then I started taking these cause like they're good for your health or something. And it has cleared up my acne so much, not to mention um, it has a bunch of other things like promotes healthy bodily functions, support immune and detoxification functions, and promotes the natural balance of gut bacteria and aids in digestion. Just sharing this in case anyone else is struggling with acne like I was. Oh my God, I have a really, really bad picture of me like flaring up after trying, after like starting to drink protein, like the powder, like I had dairy in it and I was literally breaking out so much. So I had to like get on this and I had to get on vegan protein. It was like the worst moment of my entire life. Like I was so insecure about my acne, but the secret to getting clear skin, at least I hope, it looks pretty clear, is this. We're gonna go on a hot girl walk. There's not a lot of people right now because it's like in the middle of like a session. It's um 115. Bro, why is it like low-key muddy outside? I wanna get to those picketing benches. We've settled in our little spot. Um currently at the southern quad of campus. North quad is like where my classes are, the engineering classes, which we'll go to later today. But um, yeah, I actually haven't done a day in the life in a really long time. Recently, I posted like a from academic probation to getting my dream job. And yes, I got my dream job, but recently I've been like thinking like why I'm not extremely excited to like actually start the full-time job. I think it's cause like when you're in full time, you don't have like the freedom of like a college life. Cause you know, like here I can like make my own schedule. Like if I have a break, I can like go to the gym or I can like do other things like at a full-time job. My break is my lunch break and that's literally it. I work nine to five, including traffic 
eight to six every day of my life and I don't know like how I'm supposed to do the things I want to do and also I just don't know if engineering is like my end all be all job right so that's where I'm at I feel like a lot of people are in the same boat as me recently like any accomplishments I have I'm like not satisfied or I don't like take them in for example I got this job right I like was happy for a day and then I was like okay on to the next thing I'm not like satisfied with my life for some reason oh that's the bells one of my existential crises and life realizations I've had recently that I wanted to share thank you for tuning in on to our next destination So this is like kind of a famous Yobai acai place and this is actually my first time trying it so The acai is a little frozen, a little hard to eat, but I would say it tastes pretty good It's a little expensive. This is the mini 8 ounce and it was like $6 so Good afternoon everyone, sorry for the inconvenience, um, you can send me your death certificate, <laughs> it's a joke, between 3 o'clock and 4 o'clock, 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. If not, then I'll have to give feedback to the engineers, this is the time that they prefer. Well, I think we just have to talk about like, who's going where on the presentation and who's working on what slides. On the secondary. Okay. Okay, okay. It's getting cold. I don't like it. It's like my I don't believe this. Hello, we are home. Basically, I was not able to explain what the meeting was before because I was literally running from class to get to the Zoom call on time for my senior capstone design project. We're making a new water tunnel system for the laboratory and I created like a whole like fucking art piece for it, but I do have to edit some things. I had to learn Adobe Illustrator in like an hour to like get the first initial like drawing done on time. I'm probably gonna work on that right now until my dinner I have at seven with Charlotte at a new Chinese place that I haven't tried. So I'm excited for that. We only have like an hour, so I'm gonna try to get as much drawing, sketching in done as possible. Also why we're doing it now is because we literally have a presentation tomorrow, Saturday, two to 3 p.m. with our um, project manager. And we literally only have like maybe 30% of the slides done. And this is like a full technical presentation, 30 plus slides, right? So I'm a little worried. Also the report for this, in addition to like a presentation, we have to do like a full formal report for it, which is due Monday. So there's not a lot of time, which is why we're all working on it. So last minute on a Friday. Yeah. That's yours. Oh, this is duck powder. 